Hey, Digital Demigod, this is Zach, and I'm checking out your Project 2 submission. Let's hit play and just uh, talk from here. So we got one in every crowd. So we got a, a story for this one. Nuclear warhead, oil rigs, um, imminent threat, Reagan does stuff. And there you go. There's the warheads being dropped off with terrible lighting. And that lighting is kind of terrible. And this lighting is not very good either. It makes everything look very flat. This doesn't look too terribly bad. Could be a little more dramatic. Okay, yeah. I see where your head's at, and I like it, but hang on a second. One, I might adjust that, because to me those are just a little too blatantly yellow, but, you know, hey, to each their own. But when we get to the end of the deck, it's like, wham! You can actually feel like there's some sort of second surface that he rolls off onto, and that's a little weird. Oh, cool, and I'm not crazy either. The first time I watched this, I was like, wait a minute. Watch right here. You get... Boom! Ah, I'm, I missed it. Hang on. There we go. Our wings are swept back when we're coming off the deck, right? So now we're flying, and the camera wiggles just a little bit. And now, hang on, magically, the wings have opened back up. Actually, you wouldn't be sweeping your wings back that close when you jump right off the deck, but it's all good. That doesn't look half bad. There's just something about your particles, maybe. I don't know. Maybe it's that I can see the banding so clearly that's throwing me off. I'm not sure. There's just something in this area that I'm just not feeling. What I, th I think it is that banding, because really... In a dark situation like this, that flame is going to appear very bright, and you're not really going to see a distinct white to you know, yellow-orange to gray. You're, it's going to be very, very bright and then just kind of fading back, but you know, just while we're discussing realism. I do like how you curved the, uh, one of the, some of the missiles down. That was pretty sharp. And then we fly. We're actually very maneuverable for having our wings back. If you're really trying to push this, I would work on my lighting on these scenes especially. But overall, a good effort. Just thought I'd point out some things you could work on and maybe clean up a little bit. Uh, some, like I said, some of the things I had a real problem with would be uh, the lighting here. There's no depth on that ship. It looks just like a, a flat gray wedge because the lighting is so even. Remember, you got your moon back here, and then you'd have some lights coming off from back here, and that would be it. Night on the ocean is dark very very dark and over here you got the same thing I mean it's the same color from the front of the ship to the back of the ship and that just makes the whole scene look very very flat you're losing all of your depth this doesn't look half bad I do like how you brought up the little uh, wall back there behind the jet as it takes off again I might adjust that color that's just me um, when we drop off the deck that really sudden thunk looks a little weird uh, I do know that they fall when they hit the edge of the deck, but I just don't know if they're going to really slam into a, a second deck as they go off, so you could probably smooth that out a lot. You know, it might just be your artistic decision, but I would go ahead and put his wings back out while he's taking off, because they're out in the next scene, and whether or not that's intentional or not, it is a little confusing to the viewer. So overall, a really uh, nice submission, just a few things you could fix. I thank you for it, and I look forward to seeing Project 3 from you. Take care.